President Biden has left Tulsa, Oklahoma after about a four hour visit to this city. He is the first sitting president to visit Tulsa to commemorate the 1921 race massacre. That uh, race massacre, of course, uh, resulted in the deaths of hundreds of black Tulsans. It destroyed an entire neighborhood, the neighborhood of Greenwood, where uh, Mr. Biden spoke uh, this afternoon. He also met with some massacre survivors while he was here. During his speech, he laid out in stark detail the events of May 31 and June 1st of 1921, spoke about uh, the terrible destruction that happened that day. He said it was important not to be silent about those events, that it's important to remember and to speak out. Then he turned to other issues that are very much high on his priority list, among them the attempts to redress some of the issues of uh, the racial wealth gap that continue to exist in this country. That wealth gap, of course, is seen in Tulsa as well as in neighborhoods across the U.S. He outlined a series of steps he's going to take to try to pump more money into minority communities, also to address housing discrimination and address some of the inequities in home appraisals and other types of uh, discrimination that uh, continue to take place uh, in the U.S. today. So he spoke about that, also talked about the importance of voting rights, uh, which are under assault, many Democrats say currently, spoke about uh, several other issues, including the important, importance of investing in the U.S., the importance of infrastructure, and uh, the importance of getting some of those initiatives that he's talked about passed.